Hi, my name is Frank LaRosa. I'm an ophthalmologist here at Virginia Eye Institute. I'm a glaucoma specialist. So uh, glaucoma is primarily a disease of the elderly. However, um, we start seeing glaucoma appearing as an age-related prospect in people's 40s. And so what we usually recommend is that starting at age 40, people have routine screenings for glaucoma. And depending on what the first exam shows and what your family history might be, uh, we make recommendations on the frequency of screenings. So, uh, you know, let's presume that you have uh, glaucoma in your family. Maybe your mom or dad has glaucoma and you say, geez, I should get checked out for this. Um, what you would do is call our phone line and say, hey, listen, I have a family history of glaucoma. I need to be checked out. And what we would do is set you up to have what we call a comprehensive exam. And the comprehensive exam is where we check all aspects of the eye and, and, the, and the health of the eye, looking for not just glaucoma, but, but everything else. And that's going to include the dilated exam, uh, where we look very um, intently at uh, the back side of the eye. And it's the optic nerve uh, where uh, glaucoma does the damage. So we're inspecting the optic nerve closely. When you've been given the diagnosis, most people wonder what glaucoma is. And glaucoma is a disease of the optic nerve. And for 90% of people with glaucoma, um, it's a problem with the pressure. And the eyeball is a closed system that has to fill itself with fluid. And the way that it does that is there's a ring of tissue right here between the lens and the cornea called the ciliary body that secretes fluid into the eye and it's a ring of tissue and that fluid then circulates through the pupil and gets out a ring of tissue here there's this little black dot uh, schematizes a, a canal around the front part of the eye that's the drain of the eye so it's a circular faucet if you will with a circular drain that's always running the problem with glaucoma and the problem with the human eye is the drain of the eye. Most of the time what happens is the fluid stops flowing through the drain of the eye. And when that happens, the pressure builds up inside the eye, uh, 22 or above typically, and then when that pressure builds, this is the tender spot or this is the sweet spot that takes on the damage. And that's what we call glaucoma. Most patients will ask about lifestyle choices. Um, and Everybody knows that lifestyle choices make a huge difference in things like cardiovascular disease, high blood pressure, and diabetes. Um, the good news with glaucoma is, is that there, we don't know of any lifestyle issues that really make much of a difference. And so um, I don't have to tell people to change their lifestyle. I have to tell them two things. When we ask you to use drops, please use them and please show up for your appointments. And that's about it. That's about your responsibility in treating glaucoma.